Cutting off moldy bread and cheese, is it really safe to eat? The truth might surprise you. This is a common problem, especially if it is stored in a warm and humid environment. The mold's paws are invisible to the naked eye and can grow on the surface of bread, producing a network of thread-like structures known as hyphae. These hyphae produce a variety of toxins that can be harmful to humans. Cutting off the moldy part of the bread does not make it safe to eat. Even if the visible mold is removed, there may be invisible spores that have spread throughout the bread, making it unsafe for consumption. Eating moldy bread can cause allergic reactions, respiratory problems, and even serious infections, especially in people with weakened immune systems. Furthermore, some molds can produce mycotoxins, which are toxic substances that can cause serious health problems. These toxins can accumulate in the body over time and lead to chronic health issues such as liver and kidney damage, cancer, and neurological disorders. It is important to note that not all molds are harmful, and some are even beneficial. For example, penicillin, a widely used antibiotic, is derived from a mold called penicillium. However, it is difficult to determine which molds are harmful and which are not, so it is best to err on the side of caution and avoid eating moldy bread altogether. In summary, eating bread with mold on it, even after cutting off the moldy part, is not safe. The mold can spread throughout the bread, producing harmful toxins that can cause a range of health problems. It is best to discard moldy bread and purchase fresh bread instead.